Newport Aquarium is slithering its way through the summertime. The biggest celebration, of course, is the sharks, but there are lots of other animals to see, including Nietzsche, the red tail bow. We have Mark Delves in this morning to tell us all about Nietzsche. Mark, thanks for coming in. Absolutely. And welcome fairly new to the aquarium. Yeah, yeah. Everybody still calls me the new guy. You're I've, the new I've guy? already been here for a year, but oh. they still call me the new guy. Okay, well, you're the new, <laughs> and, you're, and you're new here to us. We're glad you're here this morning yeah, to yeah. tell us Thank about, you. about Nietzsche. Okay. Yeah, so Nietzsche is a, he's a boa constrictor. Okay. And uh, he is one of our ambassador animals, actually, at the aquarium. So uh, there's a possibility you could actually meet this animal. Uh, he's, he's one of the guys uh, that goes out to schools. Yeah, uh, sure. Libraries. Uh, and uh, as an ambassador, uh, you know, we try and bring people closer to, to nature and uh, teach them and educate them about I'm, I'm, how to... I'm getting very animals. close to the nature right now. Yeah, the, na yeah, the, nature, yeah. the nature was smelling me, I think, with his tongue. Right I, absolutely, yeah. yeah. Would you like to touch him? <laughs> sure, yeah, sure, I would. He's actually got some really beautiful scales. Yeah, how, how do... How do kids react when they're when they're around a snake like this for the first That's time? That's a good question. Uh, you know, you get all kinds of different reactions from yeah. kids. Uh, you know, some kids are fearless. Some of them are, are genuinely scared. Yeah. Uh, but I think the, the the most common reaction I get is is uh, how they feel. Yeah. Uh, you would think that like slick or oily or something. Yeah, like that. Nothing, that's really right. None of that. You can see how the skin is very shiny. Yeah. Or these scales are very shiny, and uh, yeah, you would think that maybe it's like slick or right. oily, uh, like you said, and uh, it's, it's really not. It's very smooth mm -hmm. and soft. And, uh, you know, these guys are very common, commonly uh, owned as pets. I was just going to say that this is the kind of snake that a lot of people will keep at home, Absolutely. correct? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. These guys are... And, are people, and people who have them as pets swear by them. Lo I mean, really, love yeah. their snakes. Yeah, that's right. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, you know, our, our uh, snake keepers at, at the aquarium, our experts are... Yeah. Uh, are all about their uh, their reptile friends. All right. Well, you 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 got a whole lot more than just the reptile friends at the aquarium. Talking sharks this summer, other things as well. Give us the latest because people they're looking for someplace cool to go right now because yeah. it's a little bit warm outside. It so is. what does the aquarium have in store for us? Yeah. So it's still shark summer here at the aquarium. We're, we're winding down to the last few weeks of shark summer where you can still uh, bring in a, a free child okay. uh, with the purchase of an adult ticket. Okay. You can definitely go to our website to check out what those dates are and what the uh, the offers are and things like that. Nice. And uh, yeah, shark <laughs> summer. We have uh, baby sharks on display. Oh no! Do you do the song? <laughs> baby shark, shark do, 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 do. Baby shark. I, I didn't know Mark and I were going to sing today. <laughs> we just met, and already we're doing a duet. Um, <laughs> if people want to know when sort of ambassador animals are, are on display and they can come and, and meet the animals, is there a calendar for that on the website or anything like that? Uh, I'm not sure if it's actually on the website. Okay. But, but when you come into the aquarium, you can definitely take a look at our daily scheduling so and, and figure out when the animal feeds are going to take place and when the animal encounters are going to be taking place as well. Awesome. I'm sure there's probably some info on the website about it. Excellent. All right, Mark, nice to meet you. Yeah, and great to meet you too. Nietzsche, thanks for coming in. Nietzsche. I'm not going to get my face any closer because I feel like <laughs> I feel like we're close enough friends at this point. Um, Tara Blake is going to tell us about that hot forecast and she really, I think, wants to meet Nietzsche later. Tara, am I right awesome. about that? No. <laughs> No, even him like slithering no. near his chest. It's just like, what if something happens? What if something happens to him, the caretaker? I mean, I'm just already there as a mama. <laughs>